Good day, Wonder Nurses. I'm Nurse Anne. I prepared three MS questions about some of the most common topics being asked about respiratory system and disorders. Answers in rationale will also be given. So if you're ready, let's start. Question number one. During the bronchoscopy procedure, Mr. Dipsy experiences a vasovagal response during the insertion. The nurse should expect. During bronchoscopy, there is a possible pharynx stimulation that can result in vasovagal response, which can cause stimulation of the vagus nerve. The stimulation of the vagus nerve will not cause bronchodilation or midriasis, but it increases gastric secretion and the patient may experience a sudden drop in heart rate that can lead to syncope. Therefore, the correct answer is A, a drop in heart rate. Question number two. Nurse OP administered a beta-2 adrenergic agonist to patient Z during an asthmatic episode. The patient asked the nurse, what is the best evidence that the drug you gave me is effective? Nurse OP should answer that there should be A or N. Beta-2 adrenergic agonists can cause bronchodilation, which means it dilates the bronchial passages and the narrowed airways. That's why the correct answer is B. It clear breath sounds. The drug cannot be monitored for serum levels and a productive cough is not a sign of effective medication. It is also a cardiac stimulant that can cause tachycardia. Question number three. Nurse Aha has a patient diagnosed with chronic bronchitis and he is teaching him some breathing exercises. What instruction should he include in his health teaching? Patients with chronic bronchitis have a weak and flat diaphragm. So to aid in strengthening the diaphragm and to maximize its ventilation, they should perform diaphragmatic breathing. It is diaphragmatic breathing and not chest breathing that increases lung expansion. Exhalation should be longer than inhalation and the patient should exhale through pursed lips to prolong exhalation and to prevent the collapse of the bronchioles. Thank you for listening. I hope you learned and understand something. If you want more videos, don't forget to subscribe. See you in the next video.